everybody, I'm Richard Holden. It's time for another episode of Speed Secrets. Working with our friends over at Comp Cams, we're going to show you what happens when you upgrade from the factory cam to an aftermarket cam on a 408 stroker. More than that, we're going to show you what happens when you use an LS3 based rectangular port cam on a stroker equipped with cathedral port heads. Will it work? Let's find out. If you take a look at the Comp Cams catalog, you'll see that they offer LS cams designed specifically for cathedral port heads. They also offer cams designed specifically for rectangular port heads. But you know what? We mix and match them with the different heads and the different cams, and it works just great. That's exactly what we did on our 408 stroker. So let's check out that test motor, get it up on the dyno, and run it with that stock cam. To get things started, we assembled the 408 stroker test motor. Our motor featured a forged crank, forged rods, and forged pistons. We also installed a set of ported heads, a fast LSXRT intake, and a 102mm throttle body. In addition to the intake and throttle body, FAST also supplied a set of injectors and the XFI management system. To get things started on the dyno, we first equipped our 408 stroker with a factory LQ4 6 liter truck cam. Now that's assembled, let's get it up on the dyno and run that baseline. Up on the dyno and equipped with that factory LQ4 6 liter truck cam, our 408 stroker produced 449 horsepower and 522 foot pounds of torque. Now it's time for the comp cam. Our comp cam was certainly a lot healthier than that factory 6 liter truck cam. The comp cam offered 624 lift, a 239 255 degree duration split, and a 114 degree lobe separation angle. Equipped with the comp cam, our 408 stroker produced 624 horsepower and 579 foot-pounds of torque. Those are gains of 175 horsepower over the factory cam. Although we admit, how many guys are going to run the factory cam in a 408 stroker? But it does go to show you the importance of having the right cam in a stroker motor. It also tells us that you can successfully run rec port cam with cathedral port heads. I'm Richard Holdner. That's all the time I have. I want to thank the guys at Comp Cams. Join me next time on Speed Secrets.